Minute. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker, and thank you to the uh, gentleman from Minnesota for yielding me the time. Mr. Speaker, this bill is a complicated solution to a simple problem. Consumers do have the right to know what's in their food, but the problem is that right now, when you pick up a box of cereal or a bag of rice in the grocery store, you don't know if you're buying something with GMO ingredients in it. And the solution is simple. List GMO ingredients on the back of the package in the ingredient list in plain English. It's a solution that 64 other countries around the world have already adopted. Most of Europe, Japan, Russia, even China, all require a simple on-package label that anyone can read. But this bill fails to take that obvious simple step towards transparency. Instead, it calls for a QR code on the label, which would require a smartphone and a special app and a good cell signal to translate. A complicated solution to a simple problem. To be clear, knowing what's in the package does not determine the safety or health of, green, of GMO ingredients. It's about the consumer's right to know, so they can make that decision for themselves. I'm voting against this bill, and I urge my colleagues to do the same. I yield back.